Hey gang, Evan here, and today I've got a really good riddle for Globy. What do you get when you cross a mobile home with a robot? Well, yeah, I know you can't actually combine those two items. It's a riddle, Globy. Let's think about it. Robots are man-made versions of animal life. They can be programmed to see, hear, smell, and even taste the things in their surroundings. Robots use mechanical arms and legs to move around. They can go places that are too dangerous for people to go. Mobile homes are homes that can be taken or moved to the place where people will live in them. So back to my riddle. What do you get when you combine a mobile home with a robot? Athlete! Athlete is an acronym. It stands for All-Terrain Hexlim Extraterrestrial Explorer. Whew. That is a long name for a robotic vehicle that can accomplish a long list of tasks. No wonder they just call it Athlete. NASA plans to fly Athlete to the moon to help explore lunar surfaces and help set up outposts, places for people to live and work. Athlete will help travel across the rough surface of the moon on NASA's future trips there. Athlete is a six-legged vehicle with a wheel on the end of each of the legs. The legs are connected to a six-sided or hexagon-shaped frame and a flat deck for any cargo that gets carried on the moon. So athlete could potentially move equipment or a habitat. You know, a place to live. Uh-huh, now you're getting the whole robot mobile home riddle. Every face of the hexagon-shaped frame has a pair of cameras that lets athletes see what is all around it. Athlete uses two cameras, just like you use two eyes. Close one eye and try catching a ball. Not very easy, is it? But with both eyes looking at the ball, you can tell how far away it is and just where to put your hands to catch it. Athlete can send images back to Earth. The person getting those images feels like he or she is standing in the middle of the vehicle looking out everywhere in every direction. The person watching the images gets a real view of everything Athlete sees. Every leg has a wheel on the end, and the wheel is pretty small, relatively speaking. The smaller wheels are built to roll more efficiently on medium or hard surfaces. Smaller wheels are also better for the moon because they weigh less and require less power. And each leg has the ability to adapt to a power tool. Have a look at this simple gripper. And each camera placement allows the user to see exactly how the tool is being used. Let's hear more about Athlete. I think I know just the scientist. Julie Townsend from the Jet Propulsion Laboratory in Pasadena has spent a lot of time with Athlete. Athlete is a really, really cool robot, unlike any that I've ever seen before. Lots of different capabilities. It's a really high utility, very flexible, modular kind of robot. But why are robots so important in exploration? Well, we sent astronauts to the moon back in the 60s and the astronauts would live in their little lander vehicle that they landed on the moon in. And that was a stationary vehicle, it was very small actually. But that limited how far the astronauts could explore the moon. Because they would go out onto the moon in spacesuits that would carry their air, and they could only go so far away that they could get back to that lander before they ran out of air. Having a mobile habitat like Athlete would enable would let us carry the habitat with them so that that safe distance around the habitat could move. And that way they could explore the entire moon if they had enough time. Look at how Athlete can roll over bumpy ground, climb steep hills, and walk across soft sand, just like the kinds of surfaces that are found on the moon. It can load, transport, and set down cargo almost any place the astronauts need it. The Athlete vehicle is just a prototype. That means it is a model that engineers have built to test so they can see how Athlete works and what still needs to be fixed. This model is only one-fourth as big as the one NASA expects to fly in another decade or so. When research and testing is complete, NASA hopes that Athlete can move as much as 15 tons. With mobility and strength like that, they can really shoot for the moon.